Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Weekend Today in Central New York. We're looking ahead to some gorgeous weather this weekend, plenty of sun and lots of dry time, but I do want to time out a couple of chances for some showers. It's a small risk and they are looking to be very light and spotty, but still something to be in mind of for this weekend. We're also tracking some warmer temperatures heating up. Today will be warmer than yesterday, but tomorrow gets especially hot and we could see an extended heat wave looking ahead to next week, possibly four to five days in a row, right around 90 degrees. Now let's get into the forecast for this weekend, starting with a live look from our triple Doppler radar sponsored by Falso service experts. Things are still quiet this morning, seeing plenty of sun outside, expecting to keep that for the most part. We are watching a weak system passing by up to our north. Right now we're seeing some thin high clouds on the edge of this system. We'll get increasing clouds late afternoon. Then we're looking to get some showers as this weak cold front passes through, but it will be very quick and weak, so only tracking a few showers between the hours of 6 to 8 p.m. Then after sunset, all that clears out and we're looking ahead to return to sunshine heading into Sunday. However, there is another weak system that is going to slide in along this stationary front for Sunday, but doesn't look to arrive until after sunset. Sunday, so most of the day will actually be dry. Then we get some overnight showers, but they also look to be very light and spotty. No real steady or heavy rain in the forecast. Plus, we're tracking warmer temperatures. You can already see the chunk of warmer air building in across the middle of the country. These were our high temperatures yesterday. Notice it was in the 90s, stretching all the way up to North Dakota. That's what's building in for us. That moves in gradually over the next few days and then stays over us for almost an entire week. Things are really going to be getting hot and we're only 21 days away from the official start of fall. And here's our high temperatures. We'll be in the lower 80s today, which is still above average. We should be in the upper 70s this time of year. Upper 80s on Sunday, then it's low 90s for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, even Thursday. Friday will be in the mid 80s, so still pretty warm. Not far from the records either. Record of 93 for Monday and Tuesday. We could come close to tying or breaking that. The Wednesday record is a little bit higher, 97, so not as much of a close call. Let's time out the forecast for this weekend, starting with this morning. We did have temperatures in the 40s by sunrise, but now things have begun to warm up. Right now we're sitting in the 60s with plenty of sun outside, just some thin high clouds. As we go through today, warming up nicely by lunchtime, upper 70s this afternoon, lower 80s. Then we start to get some more cloud cover getting closer to four or five as that cold front arrives. That's going to bring us some showers between the hours of 6 to 8 p.m. But after sunset, those gradually shed away and then we have mostly clear skies tonight. We will have some valley fog developing through the overnight, though, and some not as cool temperatures by sunrise tomorrow, starting off in the lower 60s. So if you are heading to the fair today to sum up your forecast, sunshine to start rising into the lower 80s this afternoon, then some showers between 6 to 8. Heading into Sunday, plenty of sun, only expecting a few spotty showers after sunset will be in the upper 80s. Plenty of sun Monday through Wednesday, lower 90s, and then our next batch of rain Thursday and Friday. Now you're able